All right, it's official. Bob Melvin, he is no longer the manager of the Padres. He has accepted the manager job with the San Francisco Giants. Going back to the Bay Area, this was expected. I mean, I was going about my business talking about Bob Melvin essentially already being the Giants manager these last couple days on the show if you've been listening or watching. So this is kind of just like, okay, well, it sucks that it's official. Like, yep, he accepted the job. But we knew this was going to happen. So when I saw this notification, saw Kevin A.C. and Andrew Baggerly report that Bob Melvin, yeah, he is going to be the Giants' next manager, I didn't really have any feeling about it. You know, pretty much just, all right, let's get this manager interview process going. Um, seems like they're going to hire internal Mike Schilt or Ryan Flaherty. Seems like those are the two main guys. Uh, Kevin A.C. just reported that it's going to be a thorough search, a thorough uh, interview process here for the Padres. But I think we all know that Preller wants to hire someone that he can tell what to do. He wants to hire someone that he is in lockstep with. And if Preller continues to run this team, which is what is going to happen, I think that he has had too many chances now. He's had enough. But we know that he's going to continue running this team. I want someone that is in lockstep with him. Like, I want someone that is all in with A.J. Preller. Because, obviously, the veteran manager that doesn't agree with A.J. Preller, look how that worked out. It didn't work out well. You know, they had success in 2022, even with them not really agreeing on a whole lot of things. And then here in 2023, it fell apart and... It ended up being the most disappointing season in Padres franchise history. So maybe this is going to be the last chance for AJ. I think that a lot of Padres fans think that AJ has already had enough chances, hired a first-time manager, hired another one, those failed, brings in the right guy, Fs up that relationship with that guy, and now that guy hates him so much he's going to go and be with a less talented team in the Bay Area with the Giants. Um, he's had enough chances, but he's going to get another one. And if this one fails, if he hires whoever and this one fails, then AJ Preller has to be gone, right? This will finally be, you know, this will be the final straw for Peter Seidler, right? I thought it was already going to be the final straw. I thought this would be the final straw, but Preller's going to get another opportunity here. And it feels like he can't miss on this one. And if he's going to go down, he probably wants to go down with his guy. So it's probably going to be an internal hire, someone that he knows and trusts inside that organization. And it feels like that guy is Mike Schilt or Ryan Flaherty. I'm team Mike Schilt. Let me know who you want to be the manager of this team in the comments. It could be an external guy, but it feels like it's going to be Schilt or Flaherty. So you, you can give whatever name you want. Let me know in the comments. But, you know, Bob Melvin, just thank you. Thank you for 2022. Those memories will always be there for Padres fans, for San Diegans like myself. We're not going to forget that. Thank you for appreciating Padres fans, calling us the MVP of this season. Um, you know, taking that time, that final home game, before just going into the dugout, you paused, you clapped. To Padres fans, thanking them. Thank you, Bob. You were the best manager this Padres franchise has had in a long time, probably since Bruce Bochy. And it, it sucks that you're now leaving to the San Francisco Giants. Uh, I'm going to be rooting against you for sure come that home opener at Petco Park when you're managing in the visiting dugout. But I appreciate what you did for this Padres franchise in 2022 you wanted to make it work and unfortunately it didn't and now the Padres they're on to the next manager whoever that may be wishing that person success it just sucked that this Bob Melvin thing couldn't work couldn't work throughout the rest of his contract they couldn't coexist for one more year that's an indictment on AJ